What is the crack, ladies and gentlemen? It's Gibbo Area here with another episode of The Long Dark. How y'all doing? Okay, so, the last time we were here, we finished off our deerskin boots. They give us an unreal amount of stats. Unbelievably good for us right now. Unbelievably good. Okay. I picked up two cured gut that we had left now here in the corner. They just cured overnight. And I'm going to make my way in here. And we are going to smash up a box. There might be stuff in the box. Our guy is pretty hungry. I didn't realize that. I didn't pay attention to that. I should have paid attention to that. That's going to put a stop to this plan fairly shortly. I could eat anything right now. Well, maybe you should eat anything. <laughs> okay. We'll eat this candy bar. To get our guy going. And I need to start considering finding more food. I can't really leave as I am. Because we don't really have the food resources. I'm going to grab two of these. I'm going to grab three of these, sorry. And we are going to make snares. That's what we are going to do. Over here. Not the mittens. Not the mittens? Yeah. Give me one of these. Half an hour. Okay, I'm going to make both of these. Because we're not that low on all of our other stuff. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to top our guy off with resources. I'm going to grab a candy bar or two and bring them with us. And we are going to make our way back out to that area. With the, where we have the other uh, snare laid. And we are going to catch us a goddamn rabbit. Did I not kind of eat one of these? No. But I guess, what do we want to eat? <laughs> I don't want to touch my pile, man. I'm so proud of this. But we got it. Like, it it's not optional, really, here at this point. We, we do have to eat something. I will take a bottle of water with me, however. Do I really have to? Yeah, come on. We'll eat a we'll eat an MRE, and we'll just fill our guy up. He needs it, so it's it's not wasted. It's not wasted. It's wasted. I don't want to use our food. And let's go find me some animals. We will leave the upper dam. We're gonna make our way back into that area. Hopefully, there's no wolf here. How's the weather? No, in reality, it's probably actually about minus nine. Well, more than minus nine, but we're only feeling it as minus five because we've got really good boots on. The advantages of good equipment. You can pretty much go out whenever you want. And that's what you want. You want to be able to maximize the time that you're able to do things. Reduce the amount of time that you get trapped in an area due to weather effects. The more you can just kind of go to the weather... And go out and get... Oh, that, that stump there just put the fear of God in me. Um, the more you can just kind of tell the weather to go jog on, the better of a spot you're in to survive. Because you can go out and get shit done when you need to. So we want to find ourselves more deer hides. Pronto. Pronto. And get those legs on the go. We'll be able to get a jacket soon enough, but... Our, we've got a decent enough jacket as is, which we can repair with cloth for the time being. That jacket's also good because it scares the wolves. But our jeans, which is what our dude is wearing, are just a pair of denims. They ain't gonna hack it. They ain't gonna do it all. And the problem with these rabbits and stuff like that, catching them in the snares, is that... They will probably be frozen by the time I get to them. And they could possibly get eaten by wolves as well. Because I think they just stay there as a corpse. I think the snare just either breaks or just collapses next to it into its pickup form. If you know what I mean. We fucking got one, man. Nailed it. Boom. You'll see what I mean now. We could just shoot this. <laughs> fucking blow half of the rabbit away. We got one. We got one. We did it, Reddit. Tell me it didn't break the fucking snare. Take it. Lovely. And it's only 2% frozen, dude. Oh, so we don't pick up the rabbit, but... I am taking all of this. 
Ace. Nice. That is a that is a win right there, guys. That is a win. And there are still rabbits here. Weapons. Would it be a weapon? No. Hey, I'm getting good at this stuff. You're going to place a snare here. Here. And here. He went right through that. Yeah, bullshit. Hacks. Wall hacks. So did he. Jerks! <laughs> okay, right, screw it. No, let's get away from them. And let the... We'll let the snares do the work. We got one out of it. We've gotten a win. I hear crows. No, it's just those ones. I was kind of hopeful that there was something I hadn't discovered yet. So anyway, it's only minus two, so we're going to push on ahead like we planned. Hopefully when we come back and make our way back to the base, there may be another rabbit caught. You never know. I, I believe there's another spawn point for them further over here. I just see them over here too, so we could consider using the gut that we now have or the gut that we may get soon in the future to make him more. And we can start farming us some rabbits. Now, I don't know what the respawn rate is on the rabbits. I haven't a clue. I, I know they, they do come back after a while, but how long is a is a pertinent question. Like, how much should I invest in this and how much will I get back out of it? We've got a kilo of rabbit meat at the moment. I think that equates to about 700 calories. So we've got a bit of a meal. We've got enough to get us through a third of a day, I'd say. We'll just have to see. We'll just have to see. My phone is going like the clappers here. What's happening? Who knows? Yeah. Oh, I hit M because I wanted to bring up the map. <laughs> Wrong game, guys. Yeah, you see, we've got rabbits down here too, dude. So, like, it could be worth our while leaving a snare or two down here as well. Just, you know, it's free meat that we would otherwise not be getting. Like, you want to take what you can and exploit it. Exploit Mother Nature for the bitch that she is. Make Mother Nature your plaything, your little bitch. Now, I don't want to fall off this like I fell off the other thing. So, we are going to take our sweet ass time. Whoa. I think I can actually go down there. Do you see the crows that are down there, dudes? So, like. Yeah, no, there's a guy down there. I reckon we're going to get down there now at some stage in the near future. And we're going to loot the shit out of it is what we're going to do. I reckon there's some good stuff here. Hang on, this, this seems too convenient for there not to be things up on yonder. No, it's, it's just built this way to make it hard for you to get across. No, that's cool. That's okay. We won't drop off this because I'm not stupid. We will drop off this because I'm stupid. This is the way you're meant to actually get down without breaking your leg. Okay, no, we figured it out. Man, never mind. What do you mean, stupid? You're stupid. Minus one. That's not bad. Half tired, also not bad. Have coffee if needs be. Have resources. Can push on. Will push on. Don't have a bedroll. Concerned. Need to find a hut. Need to search this place for the food need to do. Now, this looks potentially promising. I don't see any items just floating around there. Check every nook and cranny. This game, they, they hide stuff on you. They, they don't make it easy to find the stuff. You gotta really go slowly. Let's not break a leg. You gotta really root around to find things. Overturn every stone. I mean, you overturn every stone, you know, you, it pays. There's some foot. Oh, I came up this way. I'm, I'm fucking so stupid sometimes. <laughs> okay, right. We're going to make our way on up. Get on up. Get up. Get on up. I'm going to jiggle side to side. The sassy man I am. Make our way up here. His yawn scared the absolute shit out of me there. Rabbits, and what looks to be somewhat civilization as well. Make my way around here. Want to get down there to whatever that is. 
they're just flying by, but I hear more over that way. There's probably a path down here somewhere. Human stuff, so... Loots. <laughs> Quick scoped. <laughs> I, 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 like... Rabbits are... They're big enough, but... Like, if I shot it with one of these, like, a rifle like this... With a big enough round, like, wouldn't that just, like, basically obliterate the rabbit? We want to leave a lot of snares over here, too, actually. Shit, there's, like, hundreds of them, man. These are asking to die. Like, we need to farm them before the wolves get them. That's my logic. The wolves are going to come here eventually. So by killing them, do we not... Ooh. Do we not also discourage the wolves from showing up? Cans. Food. For real. Pork and beans. My favorite. I, I don't know what that tastes like. I don't really want to know what that tastes like. Cedar. Let's make sure there's no kind of like floofy things up here. Oh, I thought I saw a round. My eye just glanced over what looked like bronze casing there, or brass casing. I don't... Uh, I don't see anything. It's warm in here, 8 degrees. We could live here if we needed to. Make our way back outside. There's nothing here that we need worry about anyway for the time being. How's our guy doing? He's tired. We, we do need to start considering doing a U-turn. I'm ignoring the mushrooms, by the way. Before anyone grows concerned, I am ignoring them. I've, I've got bigger fish to fry, so to speak. There are other things that I'm focusing on. Primarily here, I'm looking for food sources. We've got a couple here at the moment. But I want to bring stuff back to replace that MRE that we used up. I also want to give the, the snares time to actually catch something. Hmm. Okay, I guess that's not happening. <laughs> yeah, why don't we shoot a rabbit? <laughs> a rabbit. Shoot the rabbit. Monty Python jokes. If anyone's wondering. Okay. We'll hang a left. I reckon we'll probably come across a cabin or something here. We can sleep here if we needed to. We've got a couple of bits on us in terms of food, so we we could eat. We're not starving here. I figure we'll get about 400 calories out of the rabbit. This game is so pretty, man. Looking at, look at all that. like It's so nice. It's a really, really nice game. Okay. This has brought us very far away from down there. And I saw stuff in the down there, and I want to go to the down there. This isn't even letting me step over this. Like, there has to be a way. I saw a dude down there, like, so... It wouldn't show me that unless there was a way down. There's a cave there, too. How the f... Do we get there? Like... Is there one of them repel things? That's what we're going to go looking for. We're going to loot all this shit here before I, I cheese it. And then we'll see if there's one of them little repel -y bits for a rope. You and your fucking rope. <laughs> Boondock Saints. Oh, man, I haven't watched that in years. That used to be one of my favorite movies. But um, we're going to loot this. I think this brings us to the next area. So if it goes to... You're now entering the next area. I'm not going to. I know I'm sprinting, I know it's tiring us out and that, but I just want to quickly have a look over here and see if there's anything. Actually, this definitely brings us to the next area. I reckon there's a repel -y bit to get down there, if I'm honest. Absolutely. That makes total sense. If we go through this, I reckon this brings us into the next zone, which I don't want. I know this zone isn't that big, but we haven't got the resources really to be this far out. We are quite far out at this point. At this juncture, we've kind of gone a bit beyond our point of no return. Weather still ain't that bad. If there's a hood here, I could consider staying for a snooze. That's what I'm kind of hoping, is that I get around the bend, and there's a hut that I can just sleep in. I ain't really seeing diddly. Mm. 
Mm, looks like it's possible for me to get down there. That may be the way. Like, oh, shit, can I get back up here? I, I would like that very much, game. Oh, no, don't do this. Then. Right. Like, it looks like if I was to take a slide right out down here, I I could end my series. <laughs> This, it, this looks like walkable terrain, but I'm not going to test that theory on this day. I believe if I cross that, I go into the next zone. So we are going to U-turn. It's warm, actually, so our guy is actually getting temperature back here at the moment. Again, thanks to our new boots. Oh, these boots were made for walking, and that is just exactly what they're going to do. So now we are going to walk right back to the loo. No, we are going to go back and see if I can find a repel point. Because I believe that's what we're looking for, is a repel point. And that is how we're going to get down into that ravine. Now we get down there, I reckon where that train is after all collapsing into, I reckon there's a lot of shit. There's a lot of shit that we can use. So I want to get my hands on it. Most definitely. I won't sprint. I'm sorry. Don't shout at me for wasting calories. Shut up. How are we looking on calories? Calories are okay. 1300. Dry mouthed. I am. I feel dry mouthed. We have to consider those snares are up too. So we might have... I put down enough of them that I reckon we've hit something anyway. So we probably have another rabbit to skin when we get back. Hmm. We did find a couple of little things, but nothing major. And we've got an idea of how far we need to travel to... How far we need to travel to get out of here. Absolutely. There's all sorts of shit down there. There must be a rappel point or something. Has to be. Has to be. Has to be access to that. There can't not be. <laughs> I, it could just be that I have to like drop off certain points, but I, I don't believe that to be so. I reckon I need to find one of them, um, like kind of rocky outcrop things that we saw up in that tower, and that was previously mentioned in a comment too. Figure out a way to get down here. Yeah, man, there's so much stuff down there. Like maybe that's the other side of the dam. I'm I'm not really sure. No, I don't think so. No, we would have realized that before. Yeah, no, dude, there is there is definitely stuff down there. I just need to figure out how to get to it. So even here, like, it's not so steep. You know what I mean? There's trees just there on the other side. It's like it was the way through this fence here. You now we, we could look at even sliding our way down. Sidling our way down. See, so even that doesn't look so sharp there. That could be it. Hang on. Oh no, it's walled off, you jerks. It could just be that it's like there's loads of dead bodies down there type of thing, but I've seen a deer carcass, so that makes me... I'm hungry for it. Oh, there has to be a feckin' way. You can't show me that and then not give me a way down to it. You're gonna take this very handily here, by the way. I'm not risking that for a biscuit. Boom. Boom, boom. That's it. That's it right there. Has to be. Absolutely. We are going to go get a rope. We are going to abseil down this shit. And we are going to get the loot. It's, I reckon there's all sorts of good stuff down there. I reckon. I reckon, I reckon. Where did I see that rock? Where's that rocky outcrop? I saw it. I, was, I had it in my eyes. Standing there. I was looking to the right. Okay, so it's probably to the right of this. There is one. I did see it. I'm just tripping balls now. That's it. Yeah, okay. I have to no, do this little quick scopey thing to try and show it every time. I believe this is it. Oh, I'm so good at video games. We're going to go back. 
We're gonna go back and we're gonna get our shit together. We're going on an adventure, guys. That's it, we're gonna do it. We're gonna B and Q it. Don't sue me, B and Q. Thanks for the text. Okay. I'm thinking in my head, I'm doing like logistics plan. I'm gonna bring a bread roll. I wanna bring some food. If if the snares have caught some rabbits, that's gonna make this so much easier as well, because then we have the food. Then it's just okay, and we have the, the injectors in case our guy gets really tired. So if we get stuck, we can go back up the bloody rope as well. You know what my fear would be if we commit to this? And we get stuck down there. Like, does that mean I'm going into a different area altogether? And what, or what's the deal? Like, that's... Uh, so we... I don't need to bring firewood. I'll bring the tools to make firewood. We'll get wood down there. Absolutely. I have wood on me as well, to an extent. We've got a kilo of meat on us, too. Itchy nose. You know, so itchy. Did I bring a deer hide with me? Fucking dead. Jesus, such a nib. Hmm. <laughs> We have the guts of what we need. Like, I'll, I'll bring an extra liter of water, so I'll carry two. Uh, we're gonna do this. This is gonna be fun. This is gonna be good. I may die. <laughs> this could be the end. My only friend, the end. We've got no more roaches around like that, so we can't really eat the cocktails. I only said cocktail there because I realized I keep calling them roaches, so before anyone gives out, I know, but they're a rush. That's what it is. That is a, a phrase used to describe those things. Yeah, well, I wonder if we might get lucky. We might have got... <sighs> Fucking really? My wrist off this? Are you shitting me, game? There's no wolves. I'm not... I'm not bothered. It heals over time. Rest two hours. I'm just gonna fucking walk. If a wolf attacks me now, I deserve it. If I can sprain my wrist... If I sprain my wrist on a fucking rail line, I deserve to be eaten by wolves. Let's be real. Hey, rabbit. Are you fleeing the corpses of your slain brethren? Let's hope so. Close my eyes. Our dude's getting pretty tired, too. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Oh, no, it's a bag. I can force them out here. Ah! <laughs> Run to my snares. No, you're going this way. Ah, I will step on you, you little shit. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Did we get any? No, but it is only a matter of time. The next time I come through here, we might have a nice little surprise. We've got a lot of gear here at the moment, so I reckon let's make our way back. Cook up what we got get ourselves ready for our next journey. It's a solid plan. We have a lot of snares laid down there, so I, I reckon that'll, that'll bring us a rabbit maybe every day. If we're lucky, maybe two. And once we've caught another bunch at that area, I'll move them to the next site. And then hopefully we get a return on them there as well. This area seems pretty thick with rabbits. I'm going to scratch my ear and you're going to watch me doing it because that's what you guys are into, you sick weirdos. No, I'm going to miss Um... We're gonna get us ready for the next area. I reckon that's gonna be there. I reckon if we go down there, we're gonna we're gonna have some good loot. I can see this being profitable. I reckon. Do I hear a bull? We have raw meat in us too, so. Fucking knew it. The boys are back, lads. There's one to our left. Let's be chill about it. Chill, Winston. He ain't coming up on us. No. Oh, we're good. We're good. We can chill out here. Okay, we're gonna pop our head inside. Seems his visibility is now uh, nothing. <laughs> and. Before we do that, we're going to brew up a party. Again, we'll go with the wooden matches. And we're, again, each fire started here. There's nothing being wasted. I'll cook up the soup that we have here, too, just to get the calories in. But 
It's improving our fire starting skill, which is what we need. We need fire starting skill badly. I want to be getting 100% every time. Our guy needs to be good at starting fires, because if we are going to go far out, I need to know that I can get heat. We've got a bit more forgiveness now because of the the boots that we now have. They're dusty. Let's cook up the, the rabbit. The rabbit. I'm so sorry for slaughtering the Scottish accent there. Please forgive me, humans. We may well even eat these pork and beans. Cook it all up now. Mm. No. No, we don't need to back out. Okay, item. And we will very, very quickly chuck this bit of rabbit in. All 38 calories. I think the actual time it takes for us to eat it is probably consuming more calories than the actual eating of it. If you understand my, my logic there. Lovely. We'll pop back inside. Our guy needs two hours rest to fix his wrist. Which is quite doable. Okay, and here we are going to drop the deer hide, which I most certainly do not need because it's already cured. We have fresh gut, which I am going to go over here, stand on the other fresh guts, and I am going to drop the fresh gut there, and the rabbit mitten, the rabbit hide, rather, I'm going to plonk very unceremoniously right in the middle. Feels good, man. We have a toque. An extra toque. So I'm going to chuck this on the pile of clothing. Actually, it's better than the one we had. I probably should have picked it. Yeah, but it doesn't matter. It's 0.2 of a degree. I'm not really going to worry about that too much. Hmm. So, grab an extra liter. Grab an extra two liters. Grab a mountaineering rope. Which puts us up at that. We're going to lose five kilos. Remember that. We are going to lose five kilos straight off the bat. Absolutely straight away. Drop this broken arrow. Broken arrow! I have not seen that movie in ages either. Um, we're going to lose five calories, or five kilos, sorry, straight away from the mountain rope. That, like, that's going to disappear. We're not going to worry about that. And then we just make sure all our other gear is in order before we start thinking about hoofing it here. I reckon we're set. Actually, we just need to sleep. Top everything off. Good to go. Eight hours. Let's have a rest. Okay. And once I have my eight hours in, I realize all my food and stuff like that is down. And now when I wake up, I'm going to have condition problems. But we we'll solve that in a moment. Yeah, you're dehydrated. <sighs> Welcome to my world. Drink this. Get that down, yeah, buddy. The guy is kind of hungry now. They're all kind of new. Anything stale? <laughs> Weather sounds pretty bad outside too, but we are going to sleep for another wee little while, so I'm not overly concerned about that either. We're gonna have the dog food, guys. You're not gonna judge me. What I'm doing now is I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna start one more fire. I'm gonna cook up some of this grub. I realize it's pretty bad outside, but that's not really an issue for us. We're in out of the thing here, and I'm gonna be starting a fire anyway, so it's okay. Again, what are we doing? Getting our fire starting skill up. Cooking up some food here. And get that into us. Go back in and sleep. And then tomorrow, the next episode, we are going to go on an adventure. We are going to get a lot of shit. I'm going to tell you right now, I know it. We're going to come out of there with bullets. Probably another rifle. We are coming out of there with all sorts of stuff. All sorts of stuff. What is in the worst state? Oh, it actually orders it in. We can heat that up then if we want to. Okay. Let's heat up that soup. Gonna get that into us, and then the the pork and beans, I reckon. Did 
this ain't gonna this ain't gonna fill us but it's gonna be good 300 calories oh it's definitely not gonna fucking fill us Jesus. this has got 600 in it I need to cook up the dog food it'll be rotten rancid excellent we get out of this now and we're gonna eat this another 600 calories I don't think I even need to open that up. You know what, we'll eat this here anyway as well. Nice old can of peaches. 450 calories. Brings us up to 2,000. Boom. And what will I do here? I'm going to cook up a cup of joe. And I'm going to have them cold in my inventory. I'm not going to eat them. I'm going to have them in my inventory. Ready to rock. Probably going to need them tomorrow. I honestly don't think there's anything else I can get ready. We're good to go. This has been Giveaway Air, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for watching this video. Next time it's going to get interesting. If you enjoyed this video, please consider leaving a like down below and possibly consider subscribing to the channel. And if you have any comments, questions or concerns that you'd like to leave down below, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Take her handy!